What's up guys? Good morning ma'am, good morning classmates. Today, <clears throat> I'm going to teach you how to fix your computer if it's not booting up. So, there are three possible cases that this affects your computer. First, is that the RAM may produce more heat because of the improper ventilation in your computer. Now, what I mean by this is maybe the orientation of your fans is not properly placed on where it should be. Second, it is because of your corrupted OS or operating system. The third and last possible case is that your computer has a static. It is because of uh, the sudden spurt of the electricity inside your your computer now this is how we do it let's see follow me this is my PC I'm gonna try to turn it on and let's see if it's going to boot up as we can see nothing is happening the screen is still black and it's not booting up before we work on our computer we must remove the static from our body by plugging our power supply on a live outlet and then touch it for a couple of seconds and that will remove the static from your body. Now that we remove the static in our body, we can now work on our computer without worrying about the ground from it. And the first thing that I did is I removed the graphics card from the inside which is one of the biggest part of the computer now I'm going to remove the fans from the top side of my computer and from the back side which is the exhaust fan I unscrewed it from the top the two fans and then I unscrewed the one from the back After removing the graphics card, I removed the power supply in the bottom of the system unit. I laid down my, my system unit so that I can easily remove my RAM. I have the two sticks of 8GB RAM which helps to speed up my computer. I also removed the CMOS battery which is the battery of the motherboard and that is very important. Now we have to press the system unit for 3 to 5 minutes to remove the static in it. 5 minutes later. Now let's see after building it again let's see if it's going to boot up. And there you have it, the computer booted up. After opening your computer, we should go to CMD and run it as an administrator. We should type sfc slash scan now. Now what will this do is going to scan those issues in our computer. We can see that there are no issues in our computer. Now that we'd fix our computer, I would like to try it out in-game to find any issues if it's going to crash again or not this game is called call of duty modern warfare i really enjoy this game and i hope you do guys i hope that you learn something from my tutorial on how to fix your computer and i hope you enjoy this gameplay see you guys again in the next video bye bye Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him.